Good morning, I am currently sort of at the top of Cragvale that way. I've just come up Blackson Edge. Um, I'm heading down Cragvale because I'm on my way to Harrogate. So it's about 80k, about 12, 1300 metres of climbing. So it should, should take me four hours, I reckon. Um, so yeah, that is what I'm up to today. Gonna go and interview some of the, the female pros later on. So that's quite exciting. Um, but tell you what, my seat pose is creaking like crazy. I need to go and put some grease on it. It's doing my head in. This is going to be a fun descent. So I'm only at 35k in. And I've done like 700 meters and 10 of that k was downhill. Oh my god. God, it's so steep and then with a loaded bike I'm just like oh my god where's the end of this hill such steep little shits of climbs oh, but I'm on a bit of a descent now so oh god so I've just arrived in Harrogate and yeah it is packed and there's so much going on um, so I'm gonna head over to the fan zone now because I'm here with Rafa so I'm gonna go and see what the pop looks like um, hiya and then we had the cycling podcast in the evening I love a little bit more than accent there are some good accents yeah all right let's find Rafa let's go <laughs> <laughs> it's really nice, Jess! I did the other bit, but like, yeah. no, it's not good. Like, that bit's okay, that's all goes September. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so I was, that trying, I was rushing it. covered all over in your Yeah, so this is basically why I am covered in chalk paint, because wow. I Looking do good. things like this. Looking stylish. Yeah. Oh. Oh. I was a little bit sweaty. Those hills made me sweat, probably sweat more than the hill climb to be fair the other week and so um yeah thought i'd get a quick change into a, a yorkshire inspired rafa t-shirt so yeah i'm just gonna go and have well hang out here for a little bit then i want to go and see what other what other bits we've got i didn't expect it to be like such a big like festival style festival style like thing it's huge there's so many stores and stuff here, so many people. And it is only Wednesday still, so if you are thinking of coming down, come and say hello. I'm gonna be here till Friday, I think. I'm gonna ask Jess in a bit what, what are the main stuff that they've got on at Rafa. Um, but there's gonna be rides every day at 10 o'clock, I think she said, and I'm gonna be on those, so yeah. Hi, Katie. Many. How's it going? Did you ride over? Did you enjoy it? Yeah. Oh, God. Get rained on. No, it's been lovely. <laughs> Been really good. Oh, yeah. like, are you okay? I'm alright, yeah, yeah. I mean, I, this is my first day here after having a break, so I'm like. Come you ready on. for it, Vinny? You ready for yeah. it? Yeah. Like, whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> Do you want this hat? So, how long, how long you your wife want this hat? Who wants a hat? And are you doing the ride? Or are you nope. manning the. I'm, I'm you're just, manning this the. My, this is my. This is my home, home, home. prison, and. and uh, are you sleeping in the Rafa van? And, and love child, yeah. Sleep in the coffee. You know what I mean? Yeah, I sleep under the H van just for like. You know. Oh, yeah. well, we all do. We all yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we're, we're an intimate bunch here, Rafa. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely Jess is going to tell us what is on. Sorry, I was just doing my fringe. <laughs> Perfect as always. Come on. Uh, so, so we got here. We had the event program. We've already done all of these. Uh, <laughs> there's been a lot on. There has been a lot on. So not only is there events every day at the Starling, there's also a ride every morning, and sometimes there's also a gravel ride. We've got a women's evening tonight, Fox Women, we've got some Canyon Stram girls. Mm -hmm. Tomorrow we've got Alex Howes from EF. He's coming in to talk about what it's like to be a pro, just like it's daily good. life of a pro. Is that at the Starling? So that's at the Starling. Yeah. All of these are at the Starling. This day, we've got Matthew Vanderpoel and Valverde coming in. And uh, they're just gonna like chat to people, get bombarded by fans, probably we'll have to like- Selfies. Dig, we'll have to dig them out like, <laughs> go on Matthew, you can make it. We've got a women's party on Saturday night after the women's road race. Yep. And then we've got an end of the world party on Sunday. To take in. Yeah, and there's daily rides. So and daily rides, remember. Go daily to rafa.cc Yorkshire and you can find all that. There's an actual rafa. It's the kids 
yeah. it's a kids one. It must be a thing. Bargain. <laughs> Buy one. some raffa in the uh, not raffa shop. <laughs> I've had a little bit of a, a wash, quick change, and now I'm off to the Starling to go and do the um, the interview. Oh God, how lucky we with the weather. I don't think it's going to stay like this, annoyingly. But to ride all here, to stood out, nice weather, I am a happy girl. Everyone's out because they love cycling. by Tanya Eraf, who rides for Canyon Tram. Um, a big result this year, winning the sprint classification. <laughs> you look fabulous. Hi. Testing, yeah, testing. That, would, that would work. One, two, three. I guess that would. I'm sorry, I have to jump in the middle of you. A jump in the middle, jump in between. Oh, Katie sandwich. Oh, just just a, do you know why? It's probably going to be the same as what you just chatted about, so I'm like, sorry. No, that's, that's fine. Just a broken record. <laughs> I got no. used to talking about myself. <laughs> yeah, you love it. Just like, just talk love all you it. want about it. Love so. naturally. Um, I'm here with the lovely Sharon Do you just want to introduce yourselves? I'm Ella. I'm Tanya. Um, <laughs> Paris. <laughs> Ella. And so both these lovely ladies were um, went through the Zwift Academy and got their place on Kate and Sharon through that. Yes. So how how was that? Exhausting, maybe. Mm. How was it for you? It was probably the most stressful three months of my life. It, yeah. was, it was pretty awful, not going to lie. Um, I probably should promote this up to Academy, but if, <laughs> if, I, uh, if I didn't win, then I probably wouldn't do it again. It was really tough. Really? Yeah, really hard. Yeah, but it's suffering that's kind of worth it in the end. You should buy a mini rice cooker. Yeah. Because you can make porridge in it, you can make rice in it, you yeah. can make pasta in it. So now I just want to introduce them with two lovely, lovely northern women. If you want to just introduce yourselves. Yeah, I'm Mandy Jones. I was Ladies World Road Race Champion in 1982. Last time the World Championships were in the UK. So. And I'm Lisa Brambaney. I was four times National Road Race Champion and um, generally known as Abby May's mum now. <laughs> <laughs> and so what is it like, obviously, for you to have won like a, a, you know, an event like this? Like that's... It's a long time ago, for one thing. It's 37 years ago. But at the time, obviously, it was an absolutely fantastic thing, and you know, I'm really proud of it. Yeah. But not so much think about every day, normal. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I've never won the world championships. <laughs> the best I was was fifth, and I thought that was pretty good at the I time. I think it's incredible. <laughs> but just got on with it. World championships in your own country, country. doesn't yeah. come round very often. But world championships in your own county, yeah, yeah, it's well, like, yeah. uh, it's a bit special. Hard to be. Hard a bit to special. Be, yeah. Yeah, and they're doing a fantastic job. It's yeah. been great, despite the poor weather we've had. Yorkshire. Yeah. It would be Yorkshire. It would be Yorkshire. And, 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 and brilliant sunshine. And, you know, in the same day. It's the only county where you can wear your bikini and your galoshes. <laughs> <laughs> in the same hour. <laughs> God, I forgot what room I'm in. <laughs> 